<laughs> Gamification, a kind of weird idea, yet when implemented correctly, it is a powerful teaching tool that can transform classrooms for the better. Gamification is the practice of applying traditional elements of game design, such as competition and rewards, to non-game contexts, in this case, the classroom. Now, we hear the alarm bells that may be going off in your head at the mention of a reward system. In fact, many of you may hold the belief that by utilizing rewards such as candy, you inadvertently shift the attention of students away from the actual learning and towards the prize itself. Thus, by using sources of extrinsic motivation, you directly decrease a student's intrinsic motivation away from learning. However, in our experience, some of the best learning actually occurs when there is a combination of the two. We find that gamified classrooms are far more interesting and engaging, and it's exactly what our teacher Mr. Ram used. Mr. Ram is our technology teacher at ISB, and his Classrooms and teaching philosophy are heavily infused with persistent gamification. Within his classes, students can complete assignments or quests to earn coins which are then used to buy various class perks like wellness passes, rewards, and so much more. Now, this is a course fully run by gamification. However, gamification is still useful even if it's just a simple lesson. Our physics teacher, Dr. Eels, has another great approach to gamification. Oftentimes, as we reach the end of a topic, he forces us to apply our theoretical knowledge to the real world using a challenge, like calculating the kinematics of a marble or the friction coefficient of a sliding block. Students who successfully complete the challenge are rewarded with Coke, the drink. <laughs> By giving students a challenge, you, as a teacher, takes a step back. Instead, you give students the autonomy to make, um, make mistakes in a safe environment that is free from the judgment that may be present on the test. You allow them to express their knowledge in more ways. We understand that it can be incredibly difficult for a teacher to lead an entire class full of diverse individuals in a way that unlocks the full potential of each. However, the self-paced learning environment enabled through gamification allows for the customization of a curriculum better suited towards each student's individual needs and strengths. Yet oftentimes, no matter how fun or interesting a course may be, students still struggle to be engaged. If that's the case, then why are we able to do things like play video games for hours on end? It's probably because we're fascinated with the idea of gaining points and leveling up. The most glaring example of this that comes to mind is Angry Birds, which had 4 billion downloads as of 2019. Can we take a step back and be honest here? Angry Birds is essentially a game where you launch some birds at some pigs and hope that a tower collapses, and I'm being generous with that synopsis. There is no grand storyline, no beautiful graphics, and no meaningful message behind it. Yet nonetheless, the world plays five million hours of Angry Birds every single day. Millions of people fell in love with this game. Why? It was a feeling of victory and reward after completing each level. Truly a recipe for addiction. We believe it's time that we capitalize on these clearly addictive game mechanisms and redirect them towards learning. Within a gamified classroom, students' learning is imbued with a newfound purpose. Students are no longer just passive listeners in a class, but are now active players in their own game. With every single quest, mission, and homework assignment, it actively moves students towards a tangible goal. And this is extremely beneficial for their learning. In fact, a three-year study conducted by Presidia Computer Science showed that gamification, when implemented in the classroom, raised the homework completion rate by 300%. This sense of purpose sparks progress, as students find intrinsic motivation to care about their own learning. Many students may define success as absolutely acing a test. However, gamification offers an alternative metric which fits the spirit of education far better, one that argues that the real learning occurs as students work through and overcome challenges while moving towards a goal. Gamification makes students' learning relevant and applicable. They are able to cultivate skills that will help them well into the future. Furthermore, gamification gives students the ability to not only level up their scores, but also their skills, as it provides them with the freedom to fully explore a subject, make mistakes, and take risks without the fear of failure. 
Being able to make mistakes in a safe environment ultimately allows students to grow and improve. Now, we know the devastating feeling of failing a summative or completely bombing a test, but the victories that gamification helped to bring students ultimately builds courage and provides encouragement that they can keep going. Becoming proficient in something is often a long and arduous journey. However, gamification helps to breathe some life into it. Students reframe class as a adventure rather than a chore, and they find intrinsic motivation to be more proactive about their own education. Ultimately, gamification truly works and students like us truly appreciate it. As teachers in the audience, you have the ability to influence the future of education. Thus, as students, we ask that as you decide in which direction you want to move forward with, you lean into the direction of gamification. Thank, Thank you. you.